This is Brett Waltemath of Starwatch Media covering the Justice Ball at Boulevard 3 in Los Angeles, California, supporting the anti-human trafficking organization, Unlikely Heroes. How's it, how's it feel to be supporting this evening? I think it's such an amazing cause. Obviously, I feel like people don't realize how big of a deal you know, human trafficking is. You know, you see movies um, like, uh, what was the movie with Liam Neeson or his daughter? You know what I'm talking about? Yeah, like, taken. <laughs> taken, taken, yeah, taken. Teamwork. <laughs> Thank you. Taken, taken, taken too. Like you see movies like that and you realize that this stuff actually does exist. So anything that, you know, we can do to help support this cause and to stop this from happening, I am all about it. And we've spoken a lot down this red carpet about the issue of awareness, that it's an issue that a lot of people aren't aware of, that it's a problem right here in the United States, not only human trafficking, but human sex trafficking. Why do you think that is that there's not enough people here in the States that are even aware that it's an issue here? I think, I, I kind of feel like it's a lot of maybe ignorance or just, if you look at the, I feel like if you look at the people, like the kids that have been taken, you know, that are stuck in like a basement for 20 years or whatnot, um, I feel like it's just, if people just aren't aware that it could be your next door neighbor. It's like you got to look out for certain signs, like, you know, maybe awkwardness or what they uh, just like if they're if they're if they're weird in general. I mean, just like little things because you, it could be like your best friend. You could never you never would know that they're, you know, hiding 10 girls in their basement. You just don't know. So I feel like it's just kind of being aware and looking for the signs and what to really um, keep an eye out for because you never know and of course the amber amber alerts are amazing now we're getting them on our iPhones which is amazing. loud and clear oh <laughs> loud and clear a hundred percent so I think that as long as we just kind of keep pushing through and kind of making these alerts available to us we can be more positive about it and we can stop it how do you first find out about the unlikely heroes organization well, I got invited to the event, and I only go to events, especially charity events that I'm that I feel for, that I'm passionate about. Um, I, I'm involved with an anti-bullying charity, is like something that I is near and dear to my heart. So this kind of hits home for me as well, and it kind of coincides. The kind of two kind of go together. So I think it's amazing. And once I got invited to this, I said I have to be a part of it. 100%. I think it's an amazing opportunity. And it's an amazing event and I'm so excited to help raise awareness for this. I'll ask you one last question. Current and upcoming projects for you that we can see you in. I am currently on VH1's Tough Love Co-Ed. Uh, we have six more episodes. I have a couple of other um, projects in the works, but I have to keep those under wraps. So thank you very much, though. I appreciate it. Thank you so much for the time. Enjoy the rest of the evening.